Uh, good morning, uh, Gerald Kay from Helical. Uh, welcome to our offices in Hanover Square. Uh, first of all, front of house, it's very, very important. And we have Emily and Natalie behind the desk and they look after everybody that comes to visit us. Now we'll go through to my office. The first uh, thing I'm gonna show you is this wonderful picture it was taken in 1967 when the Beatles had a day uh, going around London. And here they are in front of the original building at uh, the bar at Old Street, um, having a great time by the look of it. And this is the uh, photograph signed by the original photographer who is living in Brighton. And he came and gave us this, uh, we bought this photograph from him. And obviously since then, uh, we took the building back to the frame and it's been completely reclad. Uh, we're now in my office and first of all I'd like to take you to the window because we have a wonderful view here over Hanover Square and this view has particular significance for me because uh, 20 Hanover Square which is the uh, Georgian building across the way was where I started working in 1979 at Knight Frank and Rutley a, a great firm and I, I, it was a, 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 a really good place to start my career. Next door on the right hand side there is uh, Great Portland's new development over the uh, Crossrail station, which is designed by Lifshitz, Davidson, Sanderlands, who by chance, by coincidence, are also designing our building here at uh, 33 Charterhouse Street, where we've just started the demolition and around 200,000 square feet, which we finished in May, 2022. Uh, Here's my uh, print by uh, Damien Hurst. I saw this in an art gallery in Aldborough in Suffolk, uh, where I go on holiday. And I, I just, it appealed to me straight away. And I love having it on the wall here because I find it very therapeutic and you can look at it for ages and try and work out what it's all about. But it's, it's got a good color and um, I enjoy it. Um, now, also on the desk here is the brochure for the Kaleidoscope, which is our uh, new development over the Farringdon East uh, uh, Elizabeth Line station. And uh, my uh, fellow director, Matthew Bonding Snook, has masterminded this project. And I said to him, I'm not sure you should call it Kaleidoscope. And he said, why is that? I said, well, I'm not sure the agents would be able to spell it. And of course, I couldn't even spell it myself. So there we are. And then here, before and after at the Bower, um, which is a uh, development I was mentioning earlier. And if I just open this up, you can probably see a picture of what it... There we are, what it looks like now. Great job by AHMM. So on my desk, uh, here we are, a cricket ball uh, that uh, Michael Vaughan signed when he opened our building uh, in Manchester Churchgate House. Uh, I love cricket and uh, it's a reminder of all the happy days I've spent, uh, particularly at Lords, watching uh, test matches and so on. Um, and next door to that is a box of salmon fishing flies that somebody very kindly sent me earlier this week. Um, I love salmon fishing and it's quite analogous to trying to do uh, property deals, really, because you're casting away, waiting to catch a, a fish, and certainly not every cast is successful. But when you do hook something, then it's obviously very important to uh, to land it. And uh, afraid a sign of the times, uh, the obligatory hand gel, uh, as we are in the middle of the coronavirus scenario. And here we have a chili bottle that uh, Ashby Capital sent me earlier in the week. Uh, Ashby Capital are our partners at uh, One Bartholomew, which we've now completely finished and, and let, and also at 33 Charthouse Street. And uh, it's good to have that there as a reminder, we do a huge amount of work with partners and we very much enjoy working with them all. Uh, now I'll just bring you over here. Um, a shot of my family, we were all a bit younger then. And then next door to that is uh, half the office who climbed Mount Tukbal in uh, Morocco uh, 
uh, 18 months ago, and they raised £150,000 for a charity, which was an amazing achievement, and I was really proud of, of what they did. Uh, next door to that, um, my son with a, a, a lovely salmon he caught uh, in Russia with me. I was the other side of the river, so that was a long range shot taken. And um, I was shouting instructions to him for about an hour while he was landing that fish, but I don't think he took much notice of me, but he had the expert who's sitting next door to him, uh, who's a, a, a Russian guide called Dima. And there's my daughter when she was a ski, doing some skiing in 2009. And the final thing here is um, our light feature at One Bartholomew. The instruction to the architect was to come up with something that could be seen walking up from St Paul's, and I think we've achieved that. And it's actually a barcode that says One Bartholomew. So it relates very much to the building itself.